Welcome to another episode of Miss Teacher Tube with Janice Leong. Today we're going to be looking at skip counting. We're going to start out skip counting by ones and then twos and then fives and then tens on today's episode. If you already know how to skip count by ones, you can move forward in this video to skip counting by twos, fives, tens, whichever one you need. If you already know how to do all your skip counting by ones, twos, fives, and tens, you can go to the next episode of Miss Teacher Tube. Again, any of these videos, if you're having any trouble skip counting, please rewind and practice them as many times as you need to. This is a very good skill that you're gonna need for many different math concepts, especially counting money, multiplying, dividing. This is a very handy skill to have, so please practice as much as you can. If you're a grade one student, you only need to know your numbers one to 10 really well, forward and backward. But that doesn't mean to say you can't go on and practice higher numbers. So if you wanna practice with me, go right ahead. Grade threes, if you don't know all your skip counting by twos, fives, and tens, you just go a little forward in today's episode and practice whatever you need to, just to reinforce those skills. It's also nice to practice with younger siblings in your family too. Replay this video as much as you need to to practice. Let's get started practicing by ones. So there's a pattern to skip counting by one. All of the digits, and a digit is a single number by itself. Two digits are the larger numbers that have two little numbers in them. But we're looking at the end digit, the ones digit. And the pattern is, if you skip counting by one, all the numbers will end in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, or zero. Let's get going, skip counting by one. Or well, just counting by one. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Again, feel free to rewind this. Play it as many times as you need to to practice your skills over and over again until you no longer need me and you can count to 100 all by yourself. It's also important that you be able to recognize any number I point to. You might wanna play this game with mom and dad and a 100 chart, have them point to any random number and you tell them what it is. We'll see you on Skip Counting by Two. Welcome to Skip Counting by Two. Now, if you'll notice on my 100 chart, I flipped over all my red cards that are all of my twos. 
Now there's a pattern to skip counting by two. The pattern is two, four, six, eight, zero. So if you can skip count to 10, two, four, six, eight, 10, two, four, six, eight, 10, you can skip count to 100. The ones place value will stay the same. So that's the end digit on the numbers. We'll all end in two, four, six, eight, or zero. And as you move to larger numbers down the hundred chart, that tens place value will get bigger and bigger and bigger. Let's skip count together by two. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty. 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60. 62, 64, 66, 68, 70. 72, 74, 76, 78, 80. 82, 84, 86, 88, 90. 92, 94, 96, 98, 100. Feel free to rewind this part of my video today. If you need any help, skip counting by two and practice over and over with me until you no longer need me and you can do it all by yourself. Next, we'll do skip counting by five. See you soon. Welcome to Skip Counting by Five. Now, <clears throat> fives too have a very predictable pattern. So when you're skip counting by five, again, all of the red cards are my skip counting by five, you're either going to end in a five or a zero in the ones place value. Now your tens place value is gonna get larger and larger. The bigger your numbers get, the further down the hundreds chart we move. So let's get ready to skip count by five together. Of course, we always start at zero, which isn't on here. So let's go. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. Again, if you need to practice this because you can't do it on your own, please rewind the skip counting by fives as many times as you need to to practice with me until you can do it by heart and you no longer need to look at what I'm doing. We'll see you on skip counting by 10. Welcome to Skip Counting by 10. All of my 10s are flipped over and they're red. Skip Counting by 10 can go pretty fast. The only thing we have to remember is that if you're Skip Counting by 10s, everything ends in zero. Here we go. Let's Skip Count by 10 together. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Now that we're done all of our skip counting, I have a few activities for you. Um, and on the next video series that you see from me, we'll be doing mixed skip counting. So we're going to be mixing tens and fives and ones and twos and see if we can master that because we're going to need that skill for counting money. We'll talk to you soon.
Well, that's the end of another episode on Miss Teacher Tube. I hope you practice your skip count because it's gonna come in really handy as we go on to more and more difficult lessons. That's all for today. See you next time.